About 25 minutes past the hour. Heidi, thanks for that. For those serving right now in Iraq, there is not much humor to be found in that country these days, but that is not stopping a dedicated band of comedians. Frank Buckley has our story this morning. Can I say this? Not everybody should be defending our country. <laughs> Military material, part of the act of P.J. Walsh, the headliner at Comedy Night at a small club in Corona, California. Just join the Navy! <laughs> a recent gig far from here, providing plenty of new material. Iraq was hilarious, at least for a few minutes. Every time war-weary soldiers got to see these guys on stage. They were part of a touring group of stand-ups called Comics on Duty. Forget Bob Hope, these guys aren't stars. They're the comedic equivalent of grunts who traveled like the troops across Iraq and the Middle East doing 33 shows. At times, they brought new meaning to the term bombing on stage. Yeah, so you hear like, burr, 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 and you know they're playing Dixie music, and then boom, a big explosion. Boom, another big explosion. Five seconds later, burr, 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 they just go right back into the music. They played big groups and small, 12 people in 120 degree heat, their smallest gig, their difficult mission to make warriors laugh. Your heart just goes out from that's why you're going to give everything that you can everything you can no matter how hot it is no matter you know if there's two people there we're there to get you away for a minute and we're going to do it after each show they talked to the soldiers about home and a guy actually had come up to us he had tears in his eyes and he said thank you guys so much for what you do you know he said you're saving lives out here by keeping us out of our head for a couple of hours and i mean there's no better feeling and jeffrey Steele says all of them came back with more than new material. It's been uh, nothing short of life-changing experience for me. As it was for thousands of soldiers, even if it was just for a few minutes of laughs. Frank Buckley, CNN, Los Angeles. Job well done. Yeah. yeah. So look on this morning. We've got your Wednesday.